Uh, we're going to be doing the uh, City of Tweaks, the top five for iOS 5. That's, it. That's a little bit tongue-tying, top five for iOS 5. But anyway, um, since they have come out with this notification center at the uh, on iOS 5, the developers have really, really gone wild with the way they're tweaking it and what they're adding to it. And it's it's just awesome the things that they're adding right at the beginning now, where before you had to unlock the phone and you had to go to the app and you had to open the app. Now you can do everything right from the first screen, which is awesome. And you can see here the first one I've got on here is Weather Widget. That's something that's on every device that comes from Apple. The tweaks are this here. This is the first tweak here we'll talk about is Music Center. And if I were playing a song, it would be telling me what it was right here in this block, in this little block right here. But since I don't have anything on, it's not. And you can see we could control the uh, forward, uh, rewind, stop, play. And you can also open your playlist up by, by hitting the little music symbol right here. And over here, if you want to tweet what you're listening to, you can simply tap that and it'll go to your Twitter to send a tweet. Uh, underneath here you have uh, the battery power center. Um, it has a number of things in here that you can tweak out. But first of all, let's go in here and check them out. Let's go to notifications and go scrolling down through here right here power center all right don't look like there's much you can do with it music center you can just turn it on and off um, omnistat widget see most of these you can just turn on and off there's not really a whole lot you can do with them um, but I think in time to come they will add more to them but uh, I thought you could tweak that out a little bit more but you can't you can see you got reboot, turn on and off, safe mode, respring, lock, everything right here at your at your first screen, which is Wi-Fi. This is pretty much like having SB settings right on your uh, notification screen. And this next one here is uh, is pretty cool. You can actually select the apps that you want to add right here and if you've got favorite applications you can put them in this dock here and it's you know you can add I don't know how many you can add but I added five or six and they're all there but um, this here lets you um, do some different things as well you see you can select the um, I think this may be called the power center here but uh, I've got so many centers, I've got them confused now. But anyway, uh, you see I added SB settings to my dock. That's pretty cool to have. And here you've got um, another notification center here of all of your apps, I think, that you have. You can scroll through these. This is called App Center, maybe. And you can find the one you want and select it right from the notification center. And then if you have several apps running in the background and it's eating up all your uh, memory, you can simply tap this right here to close all apps instead of having to double click, you know, how you double click before and whatever you had open would uh, would be running down here. Well, now that's not the case. Let's, let's open up a couple of them. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Let's open that one. Okay, we'll leave it running and we'll open Spy Mouse. Alright, the double click, you see both of them are running. Alright, to kill both of those at one time, instead of having to double click and hold down one of them and get them wiggling and then hit the, the minus key to, to kill off the one we want to kill off, if you want to close everything at one time, all you have to do is simply just tap this right here. All right, now when we double click, you see there's nothing here. Everything's closed. That's pretty awesome to have. Um, that's another cool 
notification center they have, they have got available and also you can put themes on your notifications now but you do that with Winterboard um, if you don't know what Winterboard is it's a uh, app you get from Stadia and it puts a little icon on your dock it looks like a little blue icon with a little snowflake on it there and when you open it up you can select different things here you can add different things here by downloading them in Cydia and if you want to put something they work on a hierarchy one above it precedes the one below it if it's check marked so keep that in mind and that's why I've got the BMW notification um, you see that there's my BMW notification so those are some uh, nice notification widget tweaks um, come over to iPhoneCaptain.com and please if you will guys like the video and subscribe it really helps me out I thank you guys for watching